boats all across the Pacific Northwest are looking closely at the Cascadia subduction zone, trying to figure out when the big one will finally hit. And the science of predicting earthquakes is still very much a mystery, but some new findings from the University of Oregon could be pointing these scientists in the right direction. The threat of the big one continues to loom over the Pacific Northwest. Scientists say it has a one in three chance of happening within the next 50 years. But when it comes to prediction, they don't know much more than that. That's a hard problem. Dr. Doug Toomey of the University of Oregon is one of the geologists hoping to solve that mystery. And he told me that some of his team's findings have given them a direction to search. We need to start looking more closely at the offshore regions. The source of the big one is the Cascadia subduction zone. It runs 620 miles up the coast from Cape Mendocino to Vancouver, and that stretch is divided into three sections. The north and the south will likely get the worst of the earthquake, and thanks to research from Dr. Toomey's team, we now know why. When we look deep beneath that plate, we see areas of buoyancy that are pushing upwards on the subduction zone. That means from around the Columbia River to the north and from Cape Blanco to the south, the damage will be most catastrophic. That's not a new revelation to scientists, but it does inform their research. Instead of looking at the surface of the tectonic plates, they should look deeper off the coast. Sometimes that's what science does for us, is it eliminates uh, something we should be looking at and points us in a direction of looking more closely at something else. Now, Dr. Toomey said on top of helping with earthquake research, their findings could actually explain the shape of the coast. In the areas where there's lower pressure, like most of Oregon, the coast range is relatively low standing. And in areas of high pressure, like the Olympics, the, topo the topography is very high. And now we have a 